Hello everybody, happy Friday. Uh, rather than fish today, we're going chicken wings. I told you I made a promise to my son, give me good grades, you're going to get your chicken wings. And <laughs> sometimes I don't feel like it. But hey, then he reminds me, mom, you taught me not to break my promises with people. So I'm trapped. All right. Can you relate? All right, people, this is Priscilla. You made up Priscilla's Kitchen LLC.com. If you're tuning in for the first time, please subscribe. A wing is made up of three parts. Uh, you have the winget or you have a drumette, the flap and a tip. All right. The drumette, the flap and a tip. So listen, when you buy them whole, they are cheaper. And I, you know, I'm cheap. Yeah, I am mad. I'm, I'm not ashamed. OK, so I buy them whole and I process them myself. So you get more yield out of it. All right. There you go. So if you buy those ones that are already pre-cut, watch the price. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and cut this all out uh, completely. What I typically do is I get my tips and, um, you know, I save the tips because they don't want that part. And then sometimes I just season it with Priscilla's or purple seasoning, salt and pepper, and I air fry. Whenever you uh, you know, you work with chicken, please go ahead and wash your hands. Sanitize everywhere because you don't want none of those bacteria. okay? It's time to season, all right? And I tell you, when I air fry that uh, tips, it, they're very crispy and I just snack on them, all right? Okay, so let's season. Priscilla's or purple seasoning, cayenne pepper, and Priscilla's house seasoning. Salt to taste, all right? My boys love a little bit of heat. That's why I also added cayenne pepper. So I'm pouring in, as you can see, about one tablespoon of uh, house seasoning. And I have te one teaspoon of... Um, of cayenne pepper and obviously about two tablespoons of priscilla's all-purpose seasoning uh salt to taste okay now some you know you could use tongs i cook with my hands when i when i'm see i'm massaging it i want to make sure this 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 the spice is rubbing into those uh chicken wings okay so i put it all in a ziploc because this is going to be marinated for four hours at least all right, I want to make sure I'm ready because once he gets off that school bus, he's asking about his wings and I want to be ready. So then now you want to preheat oil, 350 degrees Fahrenheit is the temperature we're looking at. I'm preparing a dredge and in there are two cups of all-purpose flour, a, a tablespoon of Priscilla's all-purpose seasoning, salt to taste, and then there's a, a teaspoon of... Um, baking powder just to add crispiness to these chicken wings he likes it dredged all right so here we go you want to at least fry to golden brown internal temperature of 165 degree fahrenheit some it takes about 20 to 25 minutes to to get it to that temperature all right and here we are i'm turning out the last batch here we go it's time to now sauce it remember the hot sauce i made yep i still have it all right so as you see, I'm tossing it. Now, you got to get your eyes out of the way, right? Because this is hot. It's time to plate up. Obviously, they like it with some fries this time. So, and here you go, some celery to go. Can you see how gorgeous and how saucy and just delicious that is? Hey, I cook breakfast, lunch, and dinner in my house. It's possible because I prep ahead of time. Hey, if you feel like chicken wings, make this type and leave me a comment below please subscribe share tag every single one you know and i'll see you all next time